the best bosses in Call of Duty Zombies. And no, it is not the boss baby. The Tentacle Porn Hentai Monster, aka the Marguini from Garad Krovi, which, mind you, kind of sounds like a pasta. Marguini sounds like a lovely pasta I would love to eat. Now, you've probably seen him somewhere before, like, uh, hey, I, I think I've seen him before, I think, I think I went to school with that guy. Well, you may have, um, you may have seen him on hen hentaihaven.org or the back pages, uh, in the personal section, cause that's where, uh, the Marguini is usually found. His first and main attack is to tickle that booty hole with this hentai tentacle. Now, uh, the damage of this attack, um, is equivalent to a swipe from a zombie, but it's very effective. Active, he's he'd be tickling tickling that booty every day and his second and most strong attack is to clap them cheeks so hard that it makes the earth rumble like dude he'd be clapping them cheeks harder than Tarzan did to those uh to them to them gorillas and um that's pretty hard now this uh, attack will down you if you don't have jug and red screen you if you do have jug so it's the equivalent of three hits I think um, but that's pretty that's pretty high damage you know he he be clapping them cheeks hard I'm not gonna lie the Margua mm. but not only does the Margua have really extraordinarily amazing st uh, stats he he also has some other attributes that make him easily the best boss now the first attribute would be I think how sexy this guy is now he is sexy AF I would smash him so hard. Like, he is so thick, it is comparable to Kim Possible and Gibby from iCarly. Like, and I gotta say, those are one, two of the most thickest anime characters on freaking Cartoon Network. So, I mean, that's... That's pretty good. <laughs> Like, the Margua has attributes that no other boss can really fulfill. Like, the pedophile-looking guy from 5, he... I wouldn't smash him. The the Keeper from, uh, Revelations, I wouldn't smash him. The Panzer, I mean, he... He gets me a little hard, not gonna lie, but, uh, I... He, he doesn't even come close to the, uh, to the Margua, so... The Margua is just the best. There's really no fighting it. I mean, I... I mean, I'm not gay, but I'd, uh, I'd let him clap my cheeks, you know? <laughs> Woo! Alright, I need to, uh, go jerk to, uh, some Margua hentai tentacle porn. So, you know, you know we're gonna need some lubricant. So, uh, let's open up our browser. Uh, enter this link. This is a very important link, actually. Um, two fluid ounces. I don't think it's enough. Um, four, maybe... Maybe eight. I don't know. I still don't know. Then we got here. Let's click more. See if they have any. There we go. 55 gallons of lube to masturbate to some freaking hentai tentacle uh, margua porn. This is what we need. I mean, I don't mean a flex, but uh. Spending $1,500 on lube. <laughs> oh my god, I just added that to my mother's cart. She gets notifications when things are added to her cart. So, who oh boys, uh, let me tell you what's gonna happen. <laughs> yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. I really hope you enjoyed, um... Just, man, this feels great, making a video with face cam. It, it's just so awesome, and I'm, I'm so glad to be doing it. And I, I want to say a big thanks to Dreamator9000? Yeah, I'm officially calling this a Christian channel. Um, I'm pretty sure he's saying this because I look like Jesus. Um, because, you know, that's a thing. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you want to watch more of the content. And I'll see you in another one.